Uh, Brian Branch was seen in a walking boot using a scooter. Mm. Now, again, if you're going to be in a walking boot using a scooter, uh, as seen right there. Terry uh, Arnold posted this on his Twitter. That's What's a, that? Terry on Arnold posted this picture on his Twitter. It's a fly ass suit. That is a fly suit. That is a pretty strong suit game. Not gonna lie. The Gucci but, slides. Nice. But anyway, if you're gonna be in a walking boot and a scooter, I prefer it to be in May. Sure. Um, I haven't heard anything. This was kind of a surprise of me. Flannel, have you heard anything about this? Like, what's the story? No, I, I haven't heard anything. And the thing. I understand when you see that picture and you didn't even know that Brian Branch was hurt or had a surgery or anything like that. It does look a little bit jarring. You're just kind of like, whoa, I didn't even know. You, you, you didn't think that you were going to see that on, on like, as, as part of the whole, like, draft archive when it comes to pictures. Like, oh my god, Brian Branch is hurt. What do we do? But as you said before, it is in May. And the nature of the NFL is it is a violent game. You're going to play through some nagging injuries where you're going to have off-season surgeries where you just have to clean some things up. As, and, that, and that's the thing. As NFL fans, we don't always see that. We just see them on the field, and then you see them ready for a training camp or ready for the regular season or the preseason or whatnot. But a lot of them are having these surgeries. A lot of them are probably off their feet for a month or two in the offseason because at that point, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't affect their ability to play ball. So for now, I'm just going to look at it as just one of those things where as long as we see him healthy to start training camp, preseason, regular season, preferably training camp, I'm going to probably treat it as a cleanup surgery or something like that. Yeah. He had some ankle injuries last season. He missed a couple of games. So maybe this is he played through it. He played. He wanted to obviously play through it when they were in the playoffs. And now he's just getting some surgeries so that he's all ready for next year. Okay, that's what I want to hear. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that's exactly what, but it is, it is, there's just something about the scooter. <laughs> yeah, I get you. You know what I'm saying? I get you, but it's probably just routine. If it was more serious, we would have heard something coming out of the I know, but how about you get those, like, you know how athletes always get, like, the cool crutches? Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah. we, we still get, like, the basic ass wood ones when, <laughs> when we get hurt. <laughs> you know, they get, like, the cool metal no, ones, do. you know, with, oh, like, yeah. the handle on the end of it and yeah, stuff like do. that. Like, get cool crutches or something like that. Right, well, and he has a scooter instead. I guess maybe that's an easier way to navigate. You don't hurt your your underarms or anything like that. Who knows? But I think until we actually hear more about it or until we see something, any concern going into training camp or anything like that, we should be, we, should, we shouldn't have our eyebrows raised. But it is one of those things where it's like, man, I wish I didn't have to see that.